Oh my god, these Roblox games are definitely getting out of hand. These games have gone from completely normal Roblox games to something more disturbing and even darker than you think. Okay guys, so a lot of people are actually saying that a lot of games are getting hacked and we need to know the reason why. And we don't know how there could possibly be more hackers on Roblox since Roblox changed their banned rule. So people say some weird things have been happening with Roblox system recently. Yeah, like something you'll even get banned for saying nothing. Like you will just say like somebody like, hi, nice to meet you. And then all of a sudden you will get banned for a day or even a week. So this right here, this person got banned for seven days. And it says right here, the reason was because this person said, nice meeting you. Imagine how upset you would be for getting banned for seven days for just doing nothing at wrong at all. Yeah, guys, we have seen Roblox taking down accounts just because they have a creepy backstory behind them. Yeah, it's just like this story right here, Maya. So apparently this girl's name is called Cat335. Legend has it that Cat335 was a Roblox player a while ago, but she had a different account called Catwalker. I mean, I don't know what that means, but what? it's called Catwalker. She would play Roblox with three of her friends during school, always in room 335. Things were normal for the group until Kat was found dead on her 18th birthday. No, wait, what? Her friends were heartbroken and tried to look for her every day. One day, they were online. They saw a user called Kat335 in their game, Maya. That's weird. The friends were both happy and scared, but then started to think it was fake. They got scared and called the police, but when they searched up Kat335, the account that they saw the game in didn't show up. Okay, obviously, that's not, yeah, it's not gonna come, Maya. They also tried to search up her old account Catwalker, but it didn't show up either. Then one day, one of the girls saw her in the game again and searched Cat335 and it showed up that time. Okay, guys, we need to search up Cat335, Maya, and see if it's in a true or Roblox account that will actually come up. Or did it get deleted? Okay, let's search up Cat335. Well, there is a Cat335. Oh, wait, page can no longer be found or no longer exists. Okay, okay but wait, we gotta try that Catwalker one, Maya. Wait, one year ago, this is a mysterious looking page. Is this her or is this someone else? Maya, so wait, hold on. What happened to her original account, though? I'm not sure, but maybe it did get deleted. But guys, there is this rumor about Annie. One day, a user that had been on Roblox, guys, went to the website when someone messaged them. Of course, they decided to check it out, and they found out it was actually Annie texting them. However, Annie wasn't on their friends list, and a person had friends only to chat with them. Wait, guys, yeah, that's a setting. But then they found nothing of it, as Annie had a lot of grammar errors, guys. Okay, wait. Hi, I saw your place. I think you are very good at building. If we can hang out in that place, it will become famous. So the person assumed it was a young girl trying to get famous, Maya, all right? Annie had asked this person to join their game as well. But the person didn't join her game and ignored Annie. Wow. Annie texts back, I said join my game. But the person continued to ignore them, thinking that they didn't want to deal with a first grader wanting attention. This didn't stop Annie though. Annie continued to message them, Maya. Oh my gosh guys, what the heck? The person's inbox was getting full that they stopped reading the messages and had to mute all notifications in order to play in peace. Dang. But once they locked off the website that day, Annie continued piling up in their inbox. As a result, they finally gave in and joined her as a way to make her finally shut up. Annie's view was pretty basic. Lots of cutesy pink free models, cats, dogs, flowers, and default description. Annie started asking the serving questions, such as, where do you live? They told Annie they were uncomfortable, but Annie did not stop. Maya, this is already terrifying already, Maya. If you have someone that's literally asking you, where do you live, do not answer them. Yeah, all you had to do was really leave the game. I mean, it would really suck, Maya, but honestly, too, I would kind of make a brand new Roblox account so this person would not even know who you are. So this person did do the right thing, guys, and blocked Annie, but then later, Annie kept on sending them more messages. A more people are freaking out over Dress to Impress. Okay, so Dress to Impress recently just did a new update. With this new update, people were expecting some new fun things, but they were surprised when they figured out what was going on. Okay, guys, so obviously this is a player right here, and look at all these faces. Because this is literally in and around my, you're supposed to be dressing up right now, but people can't even help but look at this face, guys. Like, what is going on with this person's face? Yeah, he's just literally changing his face into weird things. Is that, is that a cat? And she also saw this. So you guys have been warning us about this game. My Luna, my sister loves playing playing dress to impress, but I saw that creature and it was literally following me in my private server. It was so scary. I tried to leave, but I couldn't. Then my screen turned black and I think it was a glitch in my game. I just saw the same stuff, but it was a female and it would appear any time someone on the runway. Okay, so this kind of reminds me of the hack that was literally going on in Brookhaven. Yeah, it's like if someone gives you an item and all of a sudden, instead of the item picture, it would be this weird face. Instead of the actual item you're trying to give them, Maya, it literally turned into this disturbing picture. And people were literally starting to freak out, wondering if their accounts were getting hacked and if the game Brookhaven would be gone forever. So what is going on with Dress to Impress and Brookhaven? Is it all just a glitch or is it a hacker? Some people have suggested that this entire time that this is a literally just a person jump scaring people and literally trolling. So right here guys, this person has dressed up and it said how to jump scare players and dress to impress. Now we're going to take a look, Maya, and see if it's actually true. Okay, so look, obviously you can do this, Maya. As a person dressing up, you 
could go right behind them and look. They're gonna think it's real. Okay, I'm gonna be like, that's actually pretty funny. I'm gonna actually see if this is real. Now, I would not say that this is entirely the same thing that people are actually seeing though, but it definitely is something that you could be doing. Okay, so we have just entered into Dress to Impress Maya. And see, this is a very simple thing that people could be doing to scare other players. All you have to do is just go right here and put on all of these things, Maya. And obviously, it's kind of <laughs> creepy, but I don't think that this is what people have been literally freaking out about, Maya. Like, look, this does not look like the face at all. Yeah, like, there's no way that Maya and I can literally make our faces literally glitch, guys. Like, look right now. It's just this one face. Okay, oh, guys, I'm literally just hiding right here, and this one girl basically staring at me. Maya, guys, I gotta scare the people right here, Maya. They're literally sitting down. Okay, yeah, we're just gonna, um... We'll just stand in front of them. Yeah, let's see if they actually freak out. I don't know if they're actually scared. <laughs> so this all starts when you were just playing a regular round in Dress to Impress, and then this character, this same exact thing, guys. I'm not sure, Maya, if this thing literally appears like the same way in every server or what? Get the look, if you look right there by the window, what do you see? That's Lana! That is, you see oh that one. Oh my gosh, okay guys. Literally, why does it disappear so fast? <laughs> well, that definitely has to be something. There's no way. I have no idea if this is a hacker Whoa. or some people have rumored and said that this is actually something that the game developers put in the game to make sure that nobody is hacking. Well, that could be true because that also happened to Ron High, but it's the blue dress girl. Okay guys, and if you guys don't know who the blue dress girl is, it's actually a little girl who pops up and Royal High. And there's also another man named the Shadow Man. A number of Royal High players have spotted a creepy figure f watching them and following them around in their private server. They call him the Shadow Man. It is unknown what his intentions are, but if you see him in your game, you should leave immediately. Is this actually related to Lana? Okay, so this person said Lana plans to take Just to Impress, and we finally know why. Lana was unfortunately diagnosed with cancer and she was unable to pay that treatment. So she needed to start working guys at the nail salon in just to impress Maya and actually liked it. However, they refused to pay her guys. Wait, what? Probably for the treatment guys needed. Okay, this is actually her story, Maya. Okay, in these days, she would need to take off. Lana then said, when you fear me and say I'm doing this for no reason, please be mindful for why I'm even doing this in the first place. Hold up, okay. is this really Lana's story? Cause I'm saying I kind of feel bad for her. That's not the original makeup she wears. That's not the same clothes either. Like, look at her. She's right here. But guys, we could find the truth about this all in Lana's new game. So in this picture, guys, we see the Dress to Impress lobby literally covered with plants, guys, and vines. So people are actually saying that this is the new Halloween update, and this is where we're going to be able to see what actually happened to Lana. People said that in this event, the whole entire Dress to Impress will literally be in ruins, guys. Well, Dress to Impress has already noted, guys, that there will be several other things happening in an update. So Maya, if we go right here, we are already seeing one strange thing here in the game. This key that's literally in this red room. And it says, what does it say, Maya? Lana. And this wasn't even here before. Yeah, guys, so we saw when the red room was actually introduced in the game. But now this key has literally appeared. It looks like a portal, but we aren't really sure what it actually is. Could it be a portal or could it be connected to the new update? But if you guys didn't know, Lana actually does have a game, guys. And this game is called Fortress. So a lot of people actually found this room right here. And this is where you can hear Lana scream. And sometimes people can actually go into the room and Lana will begin to chase you. And we think that this is actually the real Lana locked up in her room. But but see, comment down below if you guys seen her in the game before. Well, you guys did say this. I have a story, guys. Me and my sister were playing fashion dress to impress, and things started to get creepy, guys. The creepy things started to happen my, to her and her sister. I reconnected, but she got banned in Roblox for at least six days. Whoa! Okay, so it's kind of like a thing that's kind of happening, guys. Yeah, this is like a new air code that a lot of people are talking about right now. Because if you get this air code, you might be getting banned. Let's talk about air code 524. So basically, this code is a have a lot of information but this code means that you got banned from the game. Yeah, guys, I think this code is actually something really crazy. This may be a glitch, so don't worry about it too much, Maya. But, no, it does happen when you try to do a server with, like, this picture right here. Guys, right here, this is a picture of all the people in the game, the server list. But for some reason, I think you cannot click join or something like that. You don't have permission to join this experience. Error code 524. That's kind of crazy, but Yeah, we've definitely seen that code before. Some people said, I got banned from Dress and Press. Is it permanent? I got banned from Barry Avenue. Are you kidding me, Maya? Wait, wait, wait. Well, I tried doing the hood, Emma 2, Blade Ball, and more. I get that code. Guys, so comment below right now if you guys have ever gotten this code before, Maya. I've never gotten this 524 game code when I'm trying to join any of these games. Well, yes, I did get banned before, but I never got in that code. But actually, it's more creepier, Maya, if you get banned from, like, one of the creepy Roblox games. So this cute Roblox game, guys, is not what it seems, Maya. Obviously not. This game looks like a cute bunny role 
playing game. But as you keep playing, guys, you start to notice disturbing things in the game. Whoa! What happened to that? Oh my gosh. Like, <gasps> what? Making the bunnies in this town happy by helping them, guys. So we're supposed to do all these tasks. But as you do these tasks, the game keeps getting creepier, Whoa! obviously. Like, it's like a jump scare or something. It becomes painfully obvious that this game is not <gasps> what you think. Whoa! Oh my gosh. Oh, oh my gosh. Yes! Okay, Maya. Um, oh, no, guys, no, 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 we're supposed no. to just be making the bunnies happy. But then some things happen, guys. And obviously, this game is called Bunny Tales. So, Maya, I don't know if we should play it. Well, I kind of want to because I do want to see the bunny. Well, it's already specifically says horror, guys. So, we can definitely say for sure that there's something weird. But let's just like, try Whoa, to see. Whoa, look at his badges. Wrong place, wrong time. Stop talking to me. Bon voyage. Help. What? Whoa. Okay, Luna, let's play this. We have all been patiently waiting for your arrival. You see, our town Dreamville is under the threat of falling. Whoa! Oh, oh my gosh, that is good so much. This is due to our citizens being sad, making the cloud our town rests on want to leave. Wait, what? Only you can restore the joy among our town. We hope you can help us. Okay, guys, so what did we see? Wait, we see some creepy, but... This oh! Is, what's wait, 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 wait. Maya, what did you Bro, see? I thought that guy was being dragged. Maya, it's literally just a buddy. He's using a rake. I mean, he's using a broom, guys. He's cleaning up the town. That is his job right now. Let's talk to him. What are you looking at? Whoa, chill. Chill, Jeez. okay. I thought we were supposed to be helping here. We're literally volunteers. I just over here. I lost my toy bunny. I was walking with my parents in the forest earlier today, and I dropped it. Could you please bring it to me? I'm not allowed in the forest by myself. And you think we are? <laughs> my, we're supposed to be going to the forest. Okay, let's just go. Yeah, guys, we're gonna go to the forest. This is the forest. Actually, I thought that's scary. Why is he not allowed to go here? Right? Help! Okay. I was climbing up here for fun, but I got stuck. Okay, guys. I don't know how I'm supposed to help you. Maya, they are making us do so many things, guys. I don't know. I can't do everything, Maya. There's literally a lot of stuff. What did we do? Okay, well, someone said that they lost their glasses, and I had to find a coin. Wait, Maya, what the heck, guys? There's this creepy maze right here, Maya. Okay. Okay, you know how I feel about mages, guys. Once you get stuck in there, you're literally stuck in there forever, okay? Wait, Luna, look, I found the glasses. Whoa! Whoa! Okay, you know what? I'm done, Maya. There's a knife. It, wait, the, the sunglasses literally just turned into a knife. Okay, you know what, Maya? These buddies can take care of this themselves. Well, you guys, comment down below if you guys think that game is creepy. But compared to other games that are creepier, um, it's not really, it's just, it's not really creepy. It's just kind of strange. Okay, so first of all, we need to go and get this house right here because there have been some new updates in Brookhaven. Let low, remember, it might be haunted, okay? Anyway, it goes in and then look and see for anything creepy. So this is what he wants us to do, guys. Click this weird painting right here of a clown. Maya, I don't know. This is a like, clown? Guys, I'm gonna say it looks like a prison outfit, in my opinion, but that is a what? weird, strange outfit. Go to where the sound is coming from. Okay, Maya, so apparently, guys, we're supposed to hear a sound. I don't know if it's gonna be of a clown. And what do you guys said this? I saw a hacker dressed up as a clown in a private server. Okay, so we're not entirely sure what this does actually mean, Maya, because I know, like, clown laugh, clown figures, and also even, like, weird sounds in the game. It all just sounds kind of strange, obviously, Maya. So we're gonna go and get that house right now in Brookhaven. Okay, Maya, guys, so we got the house right here. Now let's enter it, and we need to take a look at that picture, Maya. Let me see if that picture is actually right here. Where's that? Wait, guys, there is it's right here. Wait, wait, I did not expect it to actually be okay, here. So we have to click it. Guys, this painting looks so strange. Okay, you have to click it right now. But Maya, that's not the only weird picture. Like, dude, like someone can, someone explain this, Maya? It looks like a backward smile or something. No, it looks like eyes are right here, and the smile is like crooked. Okay, so do we hear anything else, Maya? I don't know. This is the house, guys. But I don't hear anything. I mean, this is the one with the secret safe, isn't it? Yes, it is. Guys, then he said to go here in the master bedroom and sit on the toilet. Then click the secret button. Are you talking about that button? Don't try this at home, my all right? Then he said to type this. Start event haunted clown. Okay, my wait, guys, the toilet. You guys do know that the toilet opens up the safe right here. And there is this glowing button, my Click it really fast. Okay, now we need to type in that code or something. Okay, guys, so here it is. Start event haunted clown. Guys, now after that, he said to check the cameras, my Okay, guys, we're gonna check our cameras. I told you guys, we're in a private server right now, but you guys did say you saw a clown in your private server, so we're gonna take a look right now. Do you see anything? I do not see anything. Okay, well, I don't really see anything. Maybe we did something wrong. I'm not really sure, but if you guys did this hack, and if you saw a clown, let us know. Yeah, Maya, because that would actually be terrifying in your private server. I'm, I'm gonna leave Maya at my house. <laughs> I'm gonna go run, I'm, and I have nowhere to run to, guys. Honestly, just leave the game at that point. Because there's this video that says, do not join the game. So if you play Roblox, stop scrolling, Maya, stop scrolling. What I day there was a girl who was playing Roblox. She was bored and went on a random game. Okay, we honestly do that from time to time, right, Maya? Yeah. When she joined it, it was just her alone in the game, but she felt like she was being watched. watched. After she got creeped out, she was about to leave until she saw a figure approaching her. The figure was a Roblox player, but he didn't show up on a server list. 
He started saying things in Japanese and the girl didn't understand. So she translated them into English and he said, Wait, what? What? Wait, Wait, she immediately left and was, was never, never seen online, online again. again. Okay, guys, obviously this is actually really weird and we don't even know what the heck this game is, but we can't play it because it's actually content deleted. Guys, but apparently this is another haunted game that you should not play in a Roblox. So we'll have to see. So the game is called The Circus. Long story short, The Circus is a creepy Roblox game that if you join the game, you're stuck inside a circus and you will find three slides. If you follow the path, a very creepy game, and yes, it's obviously, it's disturbing. Here is a clip. My friend playing the game. Where am I? It's gotten so late, I need to leave this place. Whoa. Guys, it kind of does look it's kind of interesting. Okay, so there's like what? this whole entire place right here. So I don't know if this guy's going down the slide. Okay, wait, three slides. Which one would you choose, Amaya? Red, I think my favorite blue, color. yellow. I don't know, I think I'll pick blue too. Yeah, I'm not even gonna lie. Okay, so he picked blue and funny noises. What was he dead? He's going down the slide and then he woke up guys what is up about all the static and everything okay guys so there's several circus games obviously here on roblox but it's this one i'm 100 sure it's this one this circus the circus is in town once again let's play it guys the circus play as victim or clown okay i'm gonna play as a victim because i just gotta see what happened so let's see oh my gosh guys we are here dude okay let's just can we run oh we can run my let's just run out of here let's just run really quick guys we're gonna play this really quick to see if anything scary happens should we go blue should we go red should we go yellow dude, why can't you go red you know what i'm I'm gonna follow him. Do we think should we go follow him? I don't know. I'm gonna go blue. Guys, there's this like tight rope that we have to go walk on. Oh, you guys. So someone actually said to do the red slide instead. Yeah, but we need to see what it is about right here. The red slide is apparently the right one. So let's go. Obviously, we want to pick the right one, Maya. Whoa. Whoa, this is way different from the blue. Okay, guys, what is this? Maya, I think we're kind of like stuck in a maze if you think about it now. Because we just have to walk through this area. Dude, this is actually kind of confusing, Maya. Okay, do not literally jump scare me, Maya. Oh my gosh. Because yeah. you know, I kind of, I'm like, like, I have a fear of clouds, Maya. We what? Will see. Okay, I literally so only have like one fear, and that fear is literally the things are in the ocean. Whoa, we dropped. Okay, yeah, this is totally, totally normal, Maya. We're at like the fun clown circus today. But how did you drop down? Oh, there's some balloons. What is that? Guys, there's something in the sky that is just disturbing. Well, you could grab one. I need a key, and I can't. Guys, what is it? Ah! What the heck? Did you? I told you, I told you, I told you, but they better not jump scare me. Why did they come after me like that? Guys, obviously, that is a true. I don't know if that's a horror game. I mean, you guys can play it by my, but like, that was like a complete jump scare of a clown. So maybe don't play if you have a clown fear.